Uh, our project is to build a fully automated circuit board drilling machine, which is capable of drilling different size holes on different size boards. It is to design and construct a fully automated crack repair system applicable to any size driveway, roadway, and parking lot. So basically it's a self-diagnostic automated dishwasher maintenance system. So my project is the quality control inspection system. And basically it's for assembly line processes and manufacturing environments. It's an elbow simulator which starts off as a human subject where that motion is taken from the human and then translated to five different motors that represent five different muscles in your arm and then will then drive the mechanical or the cadaver arm. The class essentially teaches students that um, how you get the system from A to Z, how you design it, how you start with the concept, how you actually design the components, how you put it together to achieve a specific function. You're applying everything that you were taught in the last four years of school that you really, you might not have really had the real feel for it when you're just reading it in a textbook. When you design a system, you need to convey it to other management what you did. So it teaches them communication skills. So in class, we present. So um, Professor El Saeed did a great job in terms of um, teaching us how to present our ideas. Now it's, it's so, it's like comes naturally to be able to just present a slideshow answer questions and that's what you're going to need in the real world. This project has a lot of focus on team building, team efforts, working with group members, so I think that's a huge aspect of this course. The first thing it teaches you is about, you know, leadership and group work and collaboration, which is one of the things that you'd be working on in the real world. Probably one of the best classes I've taken here where you just you learn every day. It was a lot of work, uh, but it's it's really rewarding seeing our machine where it is now and where we were just a 12 weeks ago.